Why, hello again, everyone. This is the inspector back with you for another shave. And today we're going with uh, shaving cream, Aqua de Parma. And I have some chill mill, PAA chill mill that I put in there. So I have a fair amount of cooling going on. I can feel it. And yes, I can smell the uh, the menthol crystals, crystals in it. And uh, we have that lathered up in our Captain Choice Copper Lather Bowl. And our Ariana and Evans synthetic brush. Got a great lather going. Pretty hydrated. And we'll need it because we are going with a Shavette today. Our Focus Slim AL. As you can see it here. There we go. And I have a Permasharp blade inside. And so we'll heat up the blade and get shaving. It's been a while since I've used a shavette. I've been shaving with my DEs lately. So. We'll give it a whirl. Hope everyone's doing well. And the weather here is absolutely perfect. New Jersey, mid-70s, sunny. It's what you expect for, uh, for middle of May. Let me draw off my fingers here, because you don't want slippy fingers when, uh, slippery fingers when you're handling a shave that, guys. Okay, there we go. And this is one of my favorite shavettes to use because I think it's so user friendly. A good shavette to use if you're just starting out. Costs you about 58 bucks or so. Sorry for the silence there, guys. Got to concentrate there because that is a, a tricky, tricky position right there. And this menthol is making my eyes water. So that's the first pass done and we'll give it a quick rinse.
Okay, we'll go for second pass here, and I can really feel the cooling now. It is really kicked in the high gear. Feels nice on a warm day. Second pass against the grain. Now I know that some of you guys go across the grain on second pass. I always go against the grain on a second pass. And that's perfectly okay. It, it, it's whatever works for you. Is fine. And this razor really shines when you go against the grain, I think. It really. Brings it home, so to speak. What I like about it is the ends are capped really nicely so you don't get that pointy edge at the end of the blade. And that is a good thing, guys, because you don't want pointy edges where you don't need it. Okay, we'll go to the other side. And I'm keeping my angle really shallow here. You don't want to open it up too much because then you'll get yourself into trouble. You open yourself up to getting cut. And that you don't want. I'm keeping the angle steady. And keeping my wrist locked. No floppy wrist here. And just maintain the angle and work your way up. Like that. Under the neck is like a sliding motion. And there's no need to hurry here, guys. Just take your time, okay? That second pass done, we'll give it a quick rinse.
Okay, we'll go for pass number three. Got plenty of suds here, guys, so no shortage of shaving cream. Nice hydrated lather here going. And again, that, that menthol is really, wow. Okay, third pass. We're going to go a second uh, against the grain. And I'm just focusing on getting the little bits that I left behind. On the second pass. Now, I know you guys are constantly saying, Inspector, you're going over the same spot. I know that. Uh, my face can take it. So that's why I'm doing it. But otherwise, I wouldn't, believe me. Here we'll go, we're going against the grain, but I'm taking a different grip onto it. And this will get the job done. And then we switch over to the other grip. And I'm doing a cross, a cross-handed thing. Uh, I don't use my right hand on my right side. Um, so, and you can do it whichever way you want, whichever feels comfortable for you. Again, keeping the wrist locked, your angle, angle shallow. And you'll know when you'll hear the whiskers cutting that that's the right angle you want and you're gonna keep it there. Don't, don't get cute and try to vary your attack, angle of attack, because it'll cost you. And we'll leave the goatee going. And we'll see how we did. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, we'll give it a final rinse.
Okay, now we'll go with the cold water. Okay. Now we'll take to the towel and woo, cool. That menthol. Very, very nice. Well, it does what it's supposed to do. We know the menthol works, guys. So, um, yeah. If you like menthol, do yourself a favor and pick up a chill mill from PAA and uh, grind some crystals into your into your soap or cream before you start. And uh, yeah, wow. All right, so we have our Focus Slim AL, which we used today and performs great. And this is very easy to unload. You just slide this mechanism over and the blade comes out. I don't think I want to do it now, but let's see if we can do it. Oh, we'll do it later. We'll do it later. Uh, what I want to do is dry it off really well. And I'll take out the blade later on and I'll pat it dry. And we'll keep it ready for next use, okay? Uh, for post shave, we'll go with the Thayer's here. Uh, very nice. So like I said, we went with the Focus Slim AL, made in Italy, very nice Shavette. We went with Aqua de Parma, also made in Italy, very nice cream. Put some menthol crystals in there for some great cooling. Captain Shores Copper Lather Bowl, Ariana and Evan Synthetic Brush. Okay guys, that's all I got for you today. Uh, thank you for joining me in, in the Inspector's Den, and we'll look forward to seeing you guys again real soon. All right, so take care, guys. Have a great Saturday. Uh, if you're on the East Coast, weather's great, so get out and enjoy. Go for a walk or whatever, and uh, just enjoy the weather, okay? Uh, take care. Bye-bye.